Hey Foothill family, I wanted to take a quick minute or two just to share with you um, something that I've learned uh, during this season um, of staying at home. Uh, you see, in seasons past when things have been challenging, um, like when we brought home newborn babies and we were up to our elbows in diapers, or the season when my mom was fighting cancer and that brought with itself its own challenges, I would make excuses for seasons like that and and say, you know what, I can't work for the Lord right now um, because I'm just in survival mode. And I know that um, God did work in me, um, giving me endurance and perseverance um, in those times and those things that he grew in me, he's used in seasons outside of the challenging ones. But I uh, want to encourage you that during this challenging season, we can be working for the Lord uh, in small and big ways. It says in Colossians 3 verse 17, uh, whatever you do in word or deed, do everything in the name of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks to God the Father through him. Paul reiterates this in verse 23. He says, whatever you do, work heartily as for the Lord and not for men. You see, when our work looks different than it did before this season hit us, uh, when our everyday purpose is something that we might not have chosen for ourselves, the idea that we work for the Lord stays the same. It says whatever we do in waking up in the morning, in getting dressed, in making breakfast for our family or for ourselves, doing the work um, that is set before us uh, for a job or just um, in making our houses uh, more comfortable or, or safer, uh, the work of prayer, whatever we do, we are to work in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ because he has given us this purpose and this work to do. I hope this is an encouragement to you um, as it has been for me. I know that this is a season and it is a challenging one, but with God's help, uh, with the help of the Holy Spirit, when we are rooted in scripture, we can do what is set before us every day and we can do it really well and we can do it in a way that glorifies God.